Yo, this is Jari9 here, and we are back with another Minecraft plugin showcase. Today we will be reviewing Recipe Lookup by Miemsum. Uh, I hope I pronounced that correctly. But let's get into the plugin. So, this plugin um, doesn't have any crafting recipes or anything like that. It is used for looking up crafting recipes, as, you, as the title of the plugin may suggest. So there is one simple command, type slash recipe, and then type in the name of a block that you want to know the recipe for. So if I put in redstone block, it will show me the recipe for redstone block. Just pops up a little GUI with the recipe and has the block. Just shows you how to make it. Really useful. And that's the simple form of doing this. You can also um, type slash recipe when holding a block and it will show you the recipe for it. Um, also blocks that need to be smelted and not crafted also can uh, be shown by this plugin. So if you type slash recipe for this stone it will tell me you need to smelt one cobblestone in order to get one stone. So it tells you how to get smelting recipes as well as crafting recipes. And also, if you have a plugin that has new crafting recipes and items in it, then this will also tap into those. So I have the grappling hook plugin installed and it uses fishing rods as grappling hooks. So if we type slash recipe fishing rod, it will show us all the different recipes for fishing rod. So there's a normal grappling hook fishing rod. I mean, that's a normal fishing rod. That's a grappling hook, grappling hook, grappling hook, grappling hook, and grappling hook. So it will show you all the different recipes if there are multiple recipes as well. Also, if there are multiple recipes, it will tell you. So, when I did the res slash recipe for fishing rod, it said there are six recipes for fishing rod. Use slash recipe fishing rod recipe number to view different recipes. So, if I type slash recipe fishing rod one, it will show me the first one in the list. If I type slash four, it will show me the fourth one in the list, and so on. So, you can also just look at specific recipes instead of having it scroll through like it was before. So this plugin is very useful if you have lots of plugins on your server that add new craftable items because uh, people will kind of freak out and won't be able to remember all the new items and they'll just be right there with one simple command away. Also it's just useful for normal uh, blocks as well you don't have to use it for other for plugins that add new craftable items like if that if you forget a crafting recipe you don't have to look it up on the wiki you can just quickly type slash recipe and then do the block and it will show you a crafting recipe so pretty useful uh, makes every recipe just one simple command away. Um, there is a config which just tells you the server what the name of the plugin is. There is also another config file that has all the crafting recipes that tells the plugin what all the crafting recipes are and their names. So you don't want to mess around with that because that can screw up the plugin. That just is a little database for all the crafting recipes and it's all stored there. So that just tells the plugin what everything is. So you don't want to mess around with that. And that's all this plugin currently has to offer. I will leave a link in the description below. Uh, I hope you download and use this plugin. Thanks for watching.